the demands of the Boro leaders were as unrelenting as they were belligerent. The basic truth is that this is some government, its officials, bureaucrats, ministers, policemen, all are anti travel. So whatever these economic packages or developmental schemes are sorted out or chalked out, this cannot be uh, sincerely implemented in two sense. So this implementation is not possible under this under tribal government and its bureaucrats. So that is where the solution is the separation, the division of Assam and creation of separate state of borderland. The central and state governments categorically refused further division of Assam, but agreed to a series of tripartite talks to diffuse the volatile situation. The AGP state government, however, insisted that the then Congress government in the center was encouraging the Boros to the path of violence. They alleged certain central intelligence agencies of instigating the Boro leaders to score political points against the state. It is not true. It is baseless. When I have been protesting these things, this is not true at all. And Mr. Mohanto, he has a sense he is the worst now. He himself has said, he said that Ro has dissociated from Epsu now. He said. And uh, Ro did not associate us a bit earlier also. We protested in his third stop. He could not produce any document also. He says that it is uh, a uh, row spent uh, three crores of rupees in Absent Movement or like that. No, unfortunately, these money that, that is spent is or, you know, these things are not documented. So you obviously will not have receipts or thing, but... Uh... No, no, no. I mean, it can be proved. This is not true at all. This is not true. In this atmosphere of charge and counter-charge, a moot point remained. The tribals in Assam were alienated and a new dimension had been added to Assam's turbulent politics. The Boro agitation directly affects only one Lok Sabha seat. Yet it was obvious to the National Front government, which replaced the Congress I in the center, as the tripartite talks continued, that the solution could be found only if genuine grievances of the tribals were addressed to. Meanwhile, however, the Boro leaders were adamant that nothing short of Boro land was acceptable to them. And our thing is very much clear. If the Boro land we are not going to accept. Boro land is the only thing that you're going to accept? Yes. And if Boro land is not given to you? There will be a struggle. For how long? Continuously. Feel it is asset. Yes, we are ready to fight. And how will you fight? We'll have to menace. Will you have violence? Anything else? Will you go underground? Not that. Not that. Will you take help of uh, countries in bordering India? No. No. We don't have society. So your fight will be within the constitution of India? Yes, within the constitution yes, of definitely. India. Definitely. We are very much democratic and constitutional. We are demanding only the constitutional provision of our...